Hello, Cancer. This is Re. I'm here today. I'm going to do you guys' love reading for the month of March. Um, for my new subscribers, hey, y'all. Thank y'all for tuning in. Um, thank you so much for your views, your likes, your subscribes, um, your comments as well. I read all of my comments. Thank you guys so much. Um, I'm ready to jump into you guys' love readings. I've been having a lot of Cancer um, privately coming to me in regards to this love reading. So let's get it popping, okay? Let's see what's coming in. What's coming towards um, cancers for the month of March in regards to love, okay? In regards to love. So let's see. There could be some conflict that you could be trying to um, balance out. <clears throat> I feel like there could be some conflict that you could be trying to balance out or you could be dealing, some of you guys could be dealing with the Libra. But I feel like there was some um, indecisiveness in a recent past. Um, you could have been feeling not sure on a decision, but I feel like what's coming to the future, I feel like you're going to be standing your ground um, in regards to a situation. I feel like a lot of you could be dealing with an air sign, um, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, um, someone that takes a more um, logical approach to things. I feel like you're desiring to be just that, same way. I feel like you guys are, um, you know, I feel like you're more focused on yourself. I feel like some of you guys could be, um, you know, becoming more independent, doing things on your own, starting up a business. Some of you guys could be just doing things, being more independent, doing things on your own. I feel like there's still a sense of um, something being a burden. I feel like Something could be weighing on you, um, but I do definitely see that there's a sense of trying to build something. And I see in a sense of possibly building a partnership here with the Three of Pentacles or, you know, you could be dealing with some um, some third party issues. But I feel like um, for me, I'm sensing more of um, building something, working towards building something. Let me clarify. Yeah, I feel like you, um, I feel like you're working towards building something with your partner. I feel like um, there could be, you know, someone could be offering you something or coming towards you um, with some type of offer wanting to build something with you. That's what I'm sensing, okay? I definitely do sense that there's a need to balance something out. It's something that you don't like. And there is definitely like a sense of thinking about whether or not 
if an opportunity is missed or whether or not if you're going to regret something. I feel like you could be thinking on whether or not or you don't like something that somebody is doing. You don't know if someone is being sneaky, manipulative, or lying to you about something. So I feel like in a recent past, you was th you was like up for the challenge. You was ready. Like you was taking, um, you know, you was ready for the challenge. But I feel like there could be something that you could that could be revealed in the near future. But I feel like there could possibly be some um, some third party issues and in in this circle like there could be some third party issues i feel a sense of sadness or feelings of regrets or feelings of not liking something um but i definitely sense that this is on your mind heavily like you're thinking about it you could be taking a break from this situation but i feel like you're feeling stuck and i feel like you're going to be you know planting seeds i feel like you're waiting you're going to be waiting to see how something turns out here Yeah, you're waiting for some type of victory or some type of recognition or like you're going to be, you're going to be planting your seeds. Clarify the moon. Okay, there could be a fire sign involved in this situation. I feel like something is possibly hidden and I feel like um, it could possibly be about a fire sign. But I feel like the situation is going to get, I feel like there's going to be um, some type of justice in the situation, though. I feel like something could possibly be hidden, you know, but I feel like justice is going to be served. I feel like something, you know, you're going to get your resolution in the end. Okay, let me clarify the Five of Cups. Why is there a sense of regrets or missed opportunity for cancer? Okay, you could be dealing with a Virgo or you could just be feeling like you would possibly want to be alone or isolate yourself. Um, I feel like you could possibly be feeling like you're doing things on your own. Yeah, you're, you're trying to find the courage and the strength and... You're taking, I feel like a lot of you are possibly taking a break from a situation because you're building up your courage, you're building up your strength, you're building up your stamina to even deal with this situation. I feel like this situation is, you know, um, you're not liking it because it's a sense of imbalance. Okay, for the three of swords. Why is the three of swords here? Okay, there's a lot of fire injury. You could find out that, you know, I feel like there's a sense of um, there could be a third party involved in this situation and it could possibly be with the fire sign, um, Leo, Sagittarius or Aries that, you know, I feel like something is being kept hidden. I feel like um, that's the situation. That's what it is that you're unhappy about and what you're not liking because you could possibly find out that somebody is, you know, being sneaky. I feel like this situation has you feeling stuck. I feel like this situation could possibly have you feeling stuck, okay? But I feel like you're gonna be you're gonna be victorious in this situation. We had to take some wands as your outcome. So I feel like you're gonna be like you plotting it. You could possibly be plotting on your next move. Make your next move your best move. That's what I'm sensing. Like, you ain't even playing at all. I'm going to get some advice from the romance angles, okay? Who must this do you have for cancer in regards to what is coming towards cancer? The energy is coming towards cancer for the month of March in regards to love.
feel like there could be some flirting going on. Okay. I feel like there could be a little bit of flirting going on, okay? You could be flirting. You could be extending your lighthearted energy to others. There could be some flirtation going on, whether it be on your end or the other individual's end. But I feel like you should ask your friends for help. Spirit is saying, um, you know, get you a circle. Get you a circle of friends to where, you know, you could ask for support from others. There's a need to have a support system here in this situation, okay? But I feel like there could be um, some time apart from your partner here because we have separation. So I feel like you and your partner could be going through a separation or there could be um, a sense of, you know, wanting to separate because you're not sure about a situation that's being kept or being hidden away from you. OK, please give me one more card for cancer. Just give me one more card for cancer. Reconciliation. So you could be reconciliating with someone from your past. Someone from your past could be returning, okay? All right. So that's going to be your reading that I have for the month of March. Um, I do sense that you guys could be going through a period of um, separation or feeling the need to, or there could be getting ready to be some type of separation, but I feel like there's going to be reconciliation right after it. You guys will be able to work you, you know, your issues out, but I feel like at this time that you should, you know, be around your friends. Get around some people that support you, that can give you encouraging words, that can help you get through your situation that you're going through. Um, but I feel like your ex could be returning, okay? There could be an ex returning or there could be, um, you know, an argument, a split, and then you guys get back together, okay? All right, so thank you guys so much for tuning in. I thank you guys. I definitely do. I appreciate you guys. For everything, all of the likes, subscribe, the shares. I appreciate you guys. And I will be back next week. I'm going to do Case of the X readings. Mm, I'm not sure which day, but it's, it's coming. It's going to be on next week, okay? All right. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Ciao for now.